All right, I'm gonna do this short video real quick. Um, I've had my locks now for about four and a half years. Uh, today is May 6, 2015. And, uh, you know, I just wanna like do an update video. I used to have a video on YouTube, but I think I deleted it. You gotta bear with me, I'm on my iPhone. <laughs> but uh, uh, this is where my hair is at after four years. Uh, I've had interlocking done and uh, I've heard mixed reviews about interlocking. Uh, I think the way the lady does it is a little uh, harsh on my hair. Uh, my wife said that my hair is starting to thin out a little bit. Uh, some of the locks are starting to thin. And I guess I can could, I could see that because I have one that's um, like damn near falling off. Where is it at? Is it this one? This one right here. Yeah, I don't know if y'all can see that, but there's only like 10 strands. That's holding it to my scalp. But, you know, as you can see, it is pretty long. So I'm probably going to end up cutting this one off. Uh, so far, I've lost one, two, three, four. This would be the fifth one over four years. Uh, a lot of the other ones either fray at the end, um, kind of like this. They get, they get soft and fray. I got quite a few that are like that. Uh, this one. Um, it's a little more severe. This one broke halfway uh, through it. Said it got skinny and weak. Uh, I have a few more. But, you know, I guess you get the point. I don't know if that's because of the interlocking or if that's because this is where my hair is. Soft, fine hair. It's not really uh, kinky. Uh, it's not thick. It's not coarse. It's kind of like, you know, this. It's just straight and curly at the same time. If that makes any sense. But yeah, I mean, it's been about two months since I've, I've got my things done. I'm thinking about doing it myself. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is it. This is it. After, after uh, four years. Uh, here's another one that's been frayed. Yeah, I don't understand that. Um, oh, also, this is a thing that's been happening. Where is it at? Uh, they like they get weak in like the middle, and then they split in half. Uh, can y'all see that? Let's see, if I can see that. Yeah. See, like it gets it gets weak and it splits in half. I've had quite a few that, that do that. I'm not sure if that's because of the way she's interlocking them or because of my hair. I, I have no idea. But uh, this one's getting ready to get cut too. Because uh, that just looks tacky. I uh, also have one uh, currently doing that on this side as well. Like it just, like it gets weak. It gets really thin. And then it just splits right there in the middle. Um, started them off as interlocking, and, I don't know, I guess it, it does stuff like this. I don't know if that's normal, um, I have no idea. I mean, I usually keep my hair moisturized, uh, usually twice a week, especially because I, I work out. Um, you know, I'm always running and sweating, uh, constantly taking a shower. Here's another one that's, that's really fuzzy. Is, is there any way to fix that? I have no idea. If, if, if you guys have a way to fix these, you know, because my loctician doesn't do it. She doesn't fix them. But, uh, you yeah, know, that's where I'm at after four years. Uh, like I said, I'll, I'll post uh, another video. Um, I know I have one somewhere of when I started, but I haven't cut them. Um, they haven't been trimmed back. I haven't cut them, except for the ones that were broken. But, uh, yeah, this is it four years and it's pretty strong so we'll see I guess if you guys have any suggestions on what to do uh, about the the fraying here you got that one and you got that one you got these two you know they're just kind of like really fuzzy at the end if there's anything I can do to fix that cool I can use the advice if not I don't know like I'm scared to cut them back because I don't want them to unravel anymore uh, even though they should unravel 
and it seems as if they are. And I don't think these have been cut. These have been cut? No, I don't think these have ever been cut. These are pretty long. So, I don't know. No, I guess if you guys have any suggestions or anything, uh, just let me know. And uh, I guess I'll post a video if I can get them fixed. If I can do it myself, actually, I'm, I should. I'm gonna post a video later. I'm gonna start doing these myself, see how they turn out, because uh, I kind of know how to do them. And I don't really feel like losing my hair, so I'm gonna try to do it myself. Just not as tight. All right, thanks you guys for watching, and uh, I'll catch y'all next time on the next video. Peace.